in this video I want to review a touch type a touch typing program that you can get for free when you're using the Chrome web browser and the name of the program is type Foo. okay let's go through some different aspects of it the first thing is in terms of all the different categories of lessons you can do um, you can see here that we are on a, the letters category okay and then within each category you've then got different levels and you could see on level one where we're now on we've just got the letters F and J whereas we've actually got 23 different levels in the category for letters and then if we move on from letters to well, I'll tell you what, two words next within the words um, menu we've got nine different levels and again each level shows you the letters which are being used for words now as well as words and letters as you may well have just seen a couple of seconds ago uh, you can practice numbers on it and in terms of numbers there are nine different levels and there we go again each of the numbers are being practiced within the, the level is shown there and then two more aspects of it within lessons are uh, you've got proverbs uh, which contains 300 proverbs a proverb is just a, a saying really a famous saying which teaches us a lesson here's one here failure is the first step to success that's in the proverbs and then the type of lesson is famous quotes and there are 325 famous quotes the perfect is the enemy of the good is a quote by Voltaire so they're just all the different types of lessons within this touch type application or program which as I said is free so now let's have a look let's go back to lessons on letters okay let's have a look let's focus now on the display what I like about this is how clear the display is okay we've got we've just got plain backgrounds and then the letters that we want to type the letters that we need to type are in bold bold and black because this is on the web there's quite a few different programs out there which actually have adverts on the screen and of course if you've got adverts on the screen and it takes away it makes the screen more cluttered but this touch type program doesn't have any adverts and that's a real plus right so let's start let's start this lesson as soon as we start it we can see the pane on the right hand side which was explaining about the type of lesson we were in for instance this is the letter section that disappears and all we've got on the screen is we've just got the letters at the top of the screen showing us um, what letters we need to press and the next letter to press is highlighted in blue and then below the letters that we need to practice is the keyboard and what I like about the way the keyboard is displayed is, is it shows the location of the letter that you need to press and it shows the surrounding letters on the keyboard um, to help you locate that letter as quickly as possible another thing you can see is that it's got a picture of a hand and a highlighted finger so that's the right hand there and the index finger is highlighted and what that's suggesting is that you use your index finger on your right hand to hit the letter J 
okay and then space the left hand appears and it's just saying for the space bar use all the fingers on your left hand and then the next letter to press is F all the surrounding letters are highlighted around the letter F to help you and it's saying you want to hit the letter F with your index finger on your left hand and so we go on now if you don't want to see the keyboard and you don't want to see the hand you can actually hide them both so let's do that now and they both go and then the screen is just the letters but of course you can bring one of those elements back. So if you just want to see the keyboard and you're not interested in seeing the hand, then just let's um, bring the keyboard back. Okay, it gives you other it gives you lots of information on how you're doing. Um, it gives you an accuracy chart of this that shows you how accurate you are and it shows you all of your lessons that you've done as against this particular session. Okay, they seem to be they seem to be the same chart, don't they? But they're displaying. Let's have a look here, what's this here? It also gives us information on the most typed keys you've, that you've used and you've practiced. There you can see they're highlighted in a, in a green colour. And then you, it will also display to you the most mistyped keys that you've that you've kind of miss hit when you're practicing the keys that you're making the most mistakes on and those are highlighted on the keyboard in red there so I think this is a fantastic uh, batch typing program which can be used and because on the internet then it can be used anywhere it's not just installed on one PC or one laptop it can be used at home or at school and I really like that flexibility. Um, you can't, one of the disadvantages is, is that you can't zoom. You can't make the letters on the screen any larger um, very easily. So although it's nice and clear because there's no adverts and there's no pretty colours or anything, any distraction from the screen, we can actually make the letters bigger. Um, another disadvantage is that we cannot we cannot add our own exercises um, and add our, our own um, kind of list of letters or list of our own words that we wanted to practice. So that's a bit of a, a disadvantage. But considering this is free, I think it's a very good piece of software for practicing touch typing.